boy, we got some mail. All right, so I got a package from Small Mini Wheels. Um, I'll show you that it's from Kyle. I'm not going to put his last name or any of the other stuff in there because that's bogus. Don't want everybody knowing everybody's um, address. Um, but I did pick up this deck from him. Um, I wanted this deck for a while, ever since I saw him skating it. And um, I never thought he would sell it. So he did tell me what it was when I asked you what that deck was because I was trying to find it like brand new. Um, and it was a plenty of chips. Unfortunately, by the time he had told me what it was, you know, they, they weren't making them anymore. Um, so I did order a plenty of chips and I got a Jackson collab, Jackson Sporting Good collab. And uh, Plenty Chips did announce on his Instagram that he is making the decks and shipping them. He had some personal stuff he was dealing with, so that's good. But I still picked this up um, just because I wanted it so bad ever since I saw um, Kyle using it in his edits. So there it is. Jerry goes to the movies. Looks like the clown took some acid. Um, kind of reminds me of my grandma's dad used to have all these porcelain dolls and like figurines in his house. And they were all clowns, but they all had like frowny faces. So it was like, I don't know, like, like depression, I guess. Like happy on the outside, but sad on the inside. It was fucked. So, um, I just, this graphic is kick-ass, and, uh, the shape is just fucking out there, and, uh, he, he was shredding on it, so, it's doable, so, there's the, there's the profile, I would say, I would say it's, it's pretty low, I'd say maybe a low to medium nose, but a, a low tail. Um, like no concave at all, which I like. Let's get a look at those plies. Plies are looking good. It's a, um, I would say it's, it's thick like a cow ply. Crispy. Really crispy. Um, and I'm thinking this is a paper graphic because he was shredding the hell out of this thing. And, um, doesn't look worn which is cool because um i like real wear but i tend to like when i buy real wares like i baby them so i want to shred this so um i don't know if this is a 34 or 32 i think it said 34 but it's looking like a 32 because this dumb one's a 34 and it is not a 34 can see a little bit of overhang and I have a cow ply which is a 33.5 it's not a 33.5 this is a 32 which I am a-okay with I am more than a-okay with Because, yes sir, yes sir, and what are we going to do for the wheels you may be asking? I have been waiting. I was going to use these on a catfish barbecue, but I think I'm going to display those decks, and I think I'm going to bust them out. I think I'm going to I think I'm going to go full retard on them and um, and just go crazy. So yeah, super hyped on this damn. I'm so glad it's a 32 now. Fuck yeah. Okay. Oh damn, but it's blue. I got some blue joy colts I could put on there. 
I'm going to put on that catfish. And I have these blue joy colts on this catfish. But they're like very, very light. Sheesh, what do I do? What do I do? I think I'm going to put the labs on it. Because these labs are pretty big. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Ooh, this is going to be crazy. This is going to be nuts. All right. Um, and then another update. So I know I did that video talking about this brewski and uh, why everybody should have a 29. So update on that. I was sessioning this today, and I was just really getting tired of the base plates that I had on this with, like, the Allen key adjuster because it just – I couldn't get it loose enough, and then when I would get it like somewhat loose enough, like I could feel them backing out because like the grind would just get rougher and rougher. I could feel the kingpin was backing out. So I've had I've I've disassembled this board truck wise more than I've disassembled any board. It's not the deck or anything. It's just like trying to get the board like tuning wise um, to my preferences has been extremely difficult because it's a 29 and it's just such a tight radius. So I put some tech deck base plates, which have a standard kingpin on them, O-ring on top and a bubble bushing on the bottom and Loctited the nut in there because I don't have any lock nuts, unfortunately. But um, yeah, it's, it's a lot better. It's a lot better. So, I'm fucking psyched on this, dude. I am psyched. Shout out. Shout out to you, Kyle. You made my fucking Friday, dude.